Hello everybody, it's Scott Omaro and I am playing in the new Snapshot 18W44A which was released today as Halloween Day and uh, it's a nice snapshot. One of the things I've been looking at waiting for is pandas weren't spawning in bamboo jungles and I have a really good seed for it and I knew they were supposed to spawn but there's been a bug and it is fixed in this snapshot. Uh, let's go ahead and get that going here. So I'm going to create a new world and I'll just call it bamboo jungle at zero because that's the cool part is the bamboo jungles add zero zero. So it makes it very easy to find and you don't actually spawn very far from that at all. So probably about 100 blocks, 150 blocks. Here's the seed. I will put it in the description as well, but let's go ahead and create the world. Uh, yeah, this snapshot is very interesting because now they've also split off ocelots and cats. So you, there will be wild cats uh, that you can tame. Uh, ocelots can no longer be tamed, uh, but they can be like made, you know, where they don't run away from you maybe uh, with fish. So that's interesting. There's some new blocks that are coming in. Uh, so Mojang is on fire right now with doing some of these snapshots and uh, that's very interesting. Hello me. There's me standing there. Okay, so this is the snapshot location uh, or the uh, seed location and so you spawn at basically negative 164, negative 28, somewhere around there. Uh, so I hear a cave around. But there's the jungle right over there so you can easily get to it. Uh, but right at zero zero, uh, there's pandas just within reach. So that's the thing is it's easy to remember. It's easy to keep up with uh, where you're at. So I'm just going to go ahead and just easily teleport there instead of following the coordinates just because it's easier for the video. Uh, so right there and over here is pandas. So they're in a little grove and there are, are also some over here. Uh, so there's quite a few pandas uh, here in this particular seed, right right at your spawn location. Um, and there's a village as well. I've, I've also seen horses, cows, donkeys, chickens, pigs, uh, sheep. There's pigs right there. Pretty much all the animals uh, are around here. There's also llamas uh, pretty close in an extreme hills. There's sheep. So... Pretty nice seed overall uh, for explore for exploration and for you know even playing and survival. Uh, let's see if we can't locate that village. I believe it's over here. Off to the edge, there's a swamp there, so you can get slime and get leads and stuff like that. Uh, so here you go with the village. Uh, it's a bit of a derpy village. There is no blacksmith, unfortunately, but again, I it's kind of derpy. They haven't fixed some of this generation in these updates look at this there's two dude you do not want to be there uh there's two houses down in the ravine here and there's villagers inside of it well there's a villager in there there's a house down here with the villager in it as well so poor guys uh maybe you want to go on a rescue mission also just to let you know there is a mine shaft down below this so you could locate a mine shaft but anyway, that's it for this video. I just wanted to show off this seed because if you want to explore pandas, uh, then I think it's quite an excellent seed. And just for Minecraft uh, animals in general, as I said, I have seen some llamas up here. I don't know if there's a spot in there. They are right over there. So uh, pretty much everything you could want right inside of this seed here. And I hope you will enjoy that and take advantage of it. And this is Scott Omato. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Like, subscribe, join the tribe, and look for more updated videos on some of the new features coming in Minecraft. Bye-bye.